Welcome to Sanka Irish Pub and Cafe. That sound of cabbage cooking on the grill can only mean one thing. It's time to gear up for St. Patrick's Day. Irish banger is a traditional Irish sausage. It is beef and pork. And we simply just grill it off. And then we just decided, you know, what can you do with this? It's traditionally served for breakfast. We just kind of put it all together and came up with the cabbage, which is a rather more of a peppered cabbage. And then a garlic sauce is something that is also known for in Europe and Ireland. Um, so we just came up with a, a horseradish garlic to give it a little zip. Are you hungry, Amy? Starving! <laughs> trying to sauce it up, you know. I like it saucy. Loved it. That was right up my alley. Any kind of like sausage of any kind like that with the cabbage, the onions and all of that. Yeah, it's, it's great stuff. After polishing off the first round, it was on to a personal favorite of mine. Stew. We sell lots and lots of stew. I mean, it's a very hearty stew. As you know, it's basically meat and potatoes and special, special herbs that we won't tell you about, our secret. But um, it's very filling, so we have a lot of students that will come in because that is a total meal for them. I'm in Flavortown. Have a I'm, day, kid. I'm like the mayor of Flavortown right now. <laughs> this stew's so good. Can't tell me any secrets, can you? No way. <laughs> very good. I'm not really a stew guy either, so I was a little nervous when I heard about it, but people talked about it, and I said, all right, I'm willing to give anything a shot once, and I loved it. The Irish banger and the Irish stew, just two reasons people flock to Sanka Irish Pub on St. Patrick's Day. A lot of people take the day off, and they find that we're the special place to be, and that makes us feel really appreciated. In Terre Haute, with the fork in the road. Yeah, here I am again. <laughs> Can't clean my plate. I'm Mike Latta, News 10.